How you doing today, Mr. Smith? Doing just fine, and you, sir? I'm doing pretty good. Uh, could you tell us what branch of the military you were in? Served in the United States Marine Corps from 1985 to 1989. 2531 communications operator. All right. Could you give us a brief description of your service? Yes. When I went in from coming out of high school, from you know, right out of Burke County, Waynesboro High School, Midfield, Georgia, um, I didn't know what I was getting into. One thing I did know, I was going in where it says to few the proud. Uh, only a few could get in, the elite. And my mindset was, as a young, young, young man going into the Marine Corps, is that I want to go ahead and serve my country, uh, travel, and just see the world, and also, as I served, learn a lot about myself and become a young man. Also, I would like to include that this branch of service has enhanced my disciplinary uh, responses to how I live and how I want to be in life. And I think for any other young man that's coming behind me, any young lady that wanted to look at the military, um, this is one of those branches that instills something solid in you, just like the rest of the branches. So I loved every bit of it. It afforded me an opportunity to be where I'm at today. All right. Thank you again, Mr. Smith. Thank you. All right, Mr. Tyson, how are you doing today? I'm fine, and you? I'm pretty good. So, um, what branch of the military were you in? I was dual service. I was in the Navy and the Marine Corps. All right, all right. Thank you for your service. Thank you for letting me serve. Yes, sir. So, could you give us a brief description of your service? Well, uh, it was rewarding. It was an adventure. I got a chance to meet a lot of people, do a lot of traveling. And one, one good part during the time I went in, uh, it was about serving. You know, it was a lot of people that we went into service then went in for the right week reason. And I'm not saying that what they're doing now, but we went in for the right reason and what that was to serve and uphold the Constitution of the United States. All right. Thank you again for your service, Mr. Tyson. Thank you. Morning, y'all. It's Ellen Peters, your nurse. And yes, I was in the military. I was in the United States Army, and I was in for only three years, but I loved every minute of it. Did you get to travel any while you were um, in the Army? I did actually get to travel. I got to travel to basic training, which was um, uh, at Fort Sam Houston, Texas. It was really hot. And then I did get to go to Germany for six weeks for um, a maneuver that we set up at an Army hospital over there and actually did surgeries in the field. and. So that was kind of fun, and um, but no, and most of the time I was stationed in Denver, Colorado, which was kind of sweet because I got to go skiing every weekend. Hey, my name is Phil, Phil Fowler. I uh, was in the Army '87 to '89, so a long time ago. Not too far from here in Savannah was where I spent most of my time. What was your favorite part about serving in the Army? Getting out. <laughs> I actually liked uh, when we did real Army stuff, like the. the I was lucky enough not to be in a wartime. I'm too young for Vietnam, too old for the Gulf War. And so, but when we did real army training, I enjoyed most of that, like the, the shooting, the loading tanks on the airplanes, jumping out of airplanes, that kind of stuff I enjoyed. Okay. Thank you. Hello, my name is Monica Reed. Um, I am a veteran. I served in the United States Army for eight years, um, from 1996 to 2004. What were your duties as a veteran? My duties while I was in the military, I was um, administrative specialist. Then I reclassed to a human resource management specialist, which is kind of the same thing. So I dealt with soldiers' pay, their leaves. I processed their awards they may have received. Um, I also worked with the, closely with the first sergeant and the sergeant major. Hey guys, Coach Gibson here. I served in the United States Navy from 1980 to 1984. Yes, I'm an old man. Um, what would you say is your favorite part of serving in the Navy? I worked on an aircraft carrier, worked on the flight deck of an aircraft carrier. Pretty exciting. Um, we got to travel a lot and I met some really good guys and, and you know, some camaraderie I guess would be the thing, the camaraderie, the brotherhood. Okay, thank you. Yes ma'am.